Hello, Ms. Kugel. We are here today at the Aspen Institute to discuss uh, the German Zeitenwende and um, negative headlines uh, about Germany's lack of um, defense capabilities have often dominated the media in the last couple of years. Um, is the 100 billion special fund, 100 billion euro special fund, enough to tackle this big issue? Well, I think it was the right decision at that time. It is, it was a good sign also to our allies that we want to spend more for defense. But if we want to improve our armed forces, then money alone is not enough because there are things that you cannot buy with money and that's a good relationship. And I think we need to improve uh, civil military relations. We need to improve the communication between parliament, politics, armed forces and civil society. We have certain institutions that, that tackle this issue as, for example, Parliament, of course, the, com the Defense Committee. We have a commissioner for the armed forces within the Parliament. We have uh, the MOD. And we even have a concept, the concept of Innere Führung within the Bundeswehr that um, supports soldiers or encourages soldiers to engage uh, with civil society. But those institutions alone and concepts alone, they don't live by themselves. So we need to use those concepts and institutions better to explain what the money is for, what we're going to buy with it, why we're going to buy it. And so I think money alone is, is not enough. We need to uh, do more of communication also with regard to the future. Thank you. You've already mentioned the relationship with German society. Modern Germany has traditionally been a more pacifist um, country, uh, although now with Russia's war on Ukraine, public opinion has shifted. Do you think public support is high enough to ensure a durable Zeitenwende? First of all, I think that the reluctance to use military force as an instrument of foreign policy is maybe strong in Germany, but it's something we have in common also with the other European states. And it's a good thing because we have, it's a good thing that our European foreign policy is concentrated on building peace in the world. And therefore, I think these pacifist ideas, they are, uh, they are European ideas. And with regard to Germany, I think it's important to explain that military or military forces play a role in a foreign policy that is concentrated on peace and that there's no contradiction, that it's not that either you pay for armed forces or you get peace, but it's the other way around. Because we want to have peace, we need to have capable armed forces in Europe, in Germany, and that's something we need to discuss more. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thanks for having me.